Well, there's a new security breach at a social networking site, LinkedIn. If you're not a member, you probably thought really ain't nothing about it. But consumer reporter John Matteris explains why it's important for everyone so you don't waste your money. Quick, what's your Facebook password? Now, don't yell it out, just think about it. Now, think about your bank or credit card password. If they are the same, you could end up in trouble. So you heard about the big LinkedIn password breach? And in the immortal words of Alfred E. Newman, you said, what, me worry? Why should I care if some business people lost their passwords? Because password theft can happen on any website. And too many of us use the same passwords all the time. I usually use the same password. I have the same one with all my accounts, with everything that I do. Don't tell me what it is. No, I'm not going to tell you what it is. Even though he knows he shouldn't, Harry Lockmiller admits he uses the same passwords at some sites. Uh, I, I do have the same password for some places, but I've got multiple passwords that I use. That's a bit better. But the news of the theft of millions of passwords from LinkedIn and eHarmony should be a warning to all of us. Sure, if someone hacks into your LinkedIn account, it's annoying. But if that ID thief gets your name and password, then starts plugging it into bank and credit card websites, they can cause serious damage. For that reason, internet security firms warn you to change up those passwords. I vary the password. I might change a different character in each one, but they're generally kind of the same. But that can be good enough to keep a thief who gets one password from hacking into all your accounts. If it's too hard to remember multiple passwords, consider changing just a couple of digits in each one. That way they are almost the same, but a thief who gets one won't have them all. That way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.